this piece is by Oliver Myrie and it is in, it's a part of the biennial, 2017 biennial at the National Gallery. There are different things that I enjoy about this piece. Um, it's a very intelligent painting for one. Um, it pulls me in. Um, the artist's use of colors, the textures, very, very interesting very dynamic as well um, there are parts of it that makes you feel relaxed or calm and then there are other parts that make you feel really excited um, again based on the way the artist um, uses material and the tools the application of the paint again the colors that he used very dramatic very exciting as a painter myself, I'm really drawn to this piece. It is a painting, but the way the artist applied his paint and um, the way he represented what he wanted to say in the piece, it's something that I would love to know how to do. Um, it's something that, as I said before, it's something that's a difference. It pulls me into the piece. It makes me curious about how the artist created it. Like all the marks in the piece seem to be well thought out. Um, well structured, but not in a way that um, turns you off from the piece. From the, from the title here it says Holy Ghost. Now that leaves a lot of interpretation, but for me um, I'm not really thinking about what the piece means. I'm thinking more about how I'm reacting to it, how it affects me just visually. Um, but if I'm supposed to put like a meaning to the piece, of course I'm gonna put a meaning that is more personal to me. So I look at aspect of the piece depending on how I feel about it. Then for me, I don't know. I don't know how to interpret this whole concept of the Holy Ghost. This piece is by Katrina Coombs. There are certain things that you're drawn to and you're not sure why you're really drawn to it. Uh, there's no definite answer as to why I love it. I just know that um, there's something about it that pulls me in. Um, outside of that, you know, I appreciate the, the material that the artist use, the expertise um, in the way the piece is constructed. It's, a, it's also done in a medium that I know that I would not be able to use or work with. So. I do respect the artist for how skillful you know, the piece is constructed. Um, for the most part, what I can identify from the materials used here, it looks somewhat like um, some natural fibers that the artist wove together. Um, there are parts of it where the material um, is more transparent, so you have a mixture of opaque and transparent materials. Um, a part of it seems to be sheer, a kind of sheer fabric which allows you to be able to see through the piece. So you have these very interesting points where you can look through the piece, contrasting with sections that are opaque, so of course you can't really um, tell what's inside. It seems to be a vessel that's holding something, something delicate, something um, that you're not sure you want to share. Um, and I guess maybe that's one of the reasons I'm really pulled in or drawn into to the piece. As a painter, I'm always bombarded by color and I think that's one of the reasons I'm drawn to the piece as well because there's no color. It allows you to feel more. It allows you to think. Um, it's quite relaxing, yet at the same time, um, it pulls you in to the point where you're curious about what's going on in between all the um, in between the nuts that are here in certain parts and then in certain sections um, you're seeing a wire and of course it's in white as well but there are range a different range of white so in a sense it's white with color and then it reflects the colors from other pieces that are in the show. The wall, the, the um, 
floor. I was actually looking at the looking and comparing the floor that part of the sculpture is in. Um, and it seems to the design on the tile seems to mimic the, the, the sculpture. So in a sense I'm sure the artist did not deliberately choose to do that, but that's one of the things that's interesting about this piece is that it feeds off other things that are in the room. So it gives it more power. I like the fact that this does not really grab me in terms of you know what it's about. It's 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 mostly um, spiritual in a sense.